<clears throat> all right guys just got back from my trip out of town i picked up this actually i can use this car later because it's pretty cool it rolls real easy has swivel wheels but it's got a little kubota three-cylinder diesel on it got the radiator he had it set up on a stand i don't know if he was he was running something with it but it's going to come in handy for what we need because we need that belt pulley this is for the fire blower this is just the stuff on the truck then i got a gravely tiller attachment and i'll show you the gravelys later i got one of those little military inline twin generators i got this big old jackson uh power plant with a wisconsin engine on it i don't know if that thing's i think the motor's locked up in this i got a little Kohler that goes with a cub cadet that i have on the trailer or could go with one i've got that big old i think it's a briggs but i'm not 100 percent sure and it's got the hand crank start got this big onan generator which it's rope pulley start it may have electric start too some of these did you could actually use hmm, let's see yep i bet it's i bet it is electric start <clears throat> then on the trailer i got a tube frame bowlings that somebody's added hydraulics to with a power steering pump still got the power steering cooler on it so that's cool and i don't know i think that's a Kohler engine on it i see they got the little i don't know if you can see it yeah that little ignition module so they've done away with the points but it's all there and in good shape got the mower deck little little gearbox to drive the mower i don't know if that's broke or that's just trash on there um got this old alice chalmers garden tractor which it has a little manual lift on the back belts to run a tiller or something i think he has all that stuff there too i just didn't get it had a mower deck but it ain't on there has an old briggs model i don't think it's a 23 it's a model whatever the next size down is but it's a b12 b neat little decal and they got the little telltale steering wheel seat and fenders on all the alice chalmers it does have a little snow plow which is just manual raise and lower get back to this in a minute here's one of the cub cadets which has a motor in it he's got two or three more out there i got to go get or probably actually four or five more it's a model 70 so it's gear driven uh the odd numbers were hydrostatic drive the even numbers were gear driven got this really cool little walk behind tractor with a wisconsin on it that actually turns over and has compression so that one will probably run i got a gravely which there's several more of them to pick up with a rotary mower attachment and then that tiller attachment will go with it these little things were cool because the transmission and everything was like full pressure lubrication kind of like a tractor and they have a clutch set up in here for running the mower you could get dual wheel attachments for these they had sulkies which there's one of them out there i didn't grab and you can go online and look up all the stuff they made for these there's even a backhoe attachment for these gravelies which is really cool and this one does have the electric start which is nice and i guess it ain't going to be that nice since the motor's locked up no biggie i can probably get it unstuck got this death trap which you could run horizontally or vertically or at a 45 by moving that lever and tilting this whole assembly up or down it's got some homemade tires on it that were made out of some type of old hose and i think yeah that engine's freed up also a wisconsin i had lots of wisconsin engines out there there's a cub cadet clutch they used on a lot of their stuff which i'm sure it's locked up tight cool little original ford grill shell got another wisconsin this is hand crank only 
it ran a water pump and i think the pumps out there you can see that marlo marlo pumps i don't know if this one's stuck yet or not but it's a little inline twin and it had that got bent but it had this little cover and for the exhaust i'm not really sure what this setup was unless that was some type of priming system maybe for the water pump who knows and then i got the little cushman three-wheel scooter it's got the original i believe it's a husky motor in it with the kickstart so i have ac i don't know if it's the correct one but it's got a clutch brake gas there's your stick shift has a manual transmission i don't remember how many gears was in it i think there's three <clears throat> and then in the little cushman truck i don't know if this dumps or not there's a omc oh man there's an omc twin i believe it's just a twin yeah that come out of one of these things he had and then of course i got some old steel wheels and rims and just junk whatever was in this i got so i don't know if there's anything in here worth a dang there's a hub off an old wheel a really old one but there might be some more treasures down in there oh and this cub has a deck on it i don't know what i'm gonna do with these but <sighs> there'll be several will it run videos these things are really cool this one actually looks like i think it was supposed to have a variable clutch drive on it maybe that just turned it on and off but anyways <clears throat> lots of cool little treasures on the trailer today there's a three hour drive down there and a three hour drive back obviously oh and this one has some nice little heavy wheel weights this one will be cool if it'll run because i don't know what the hydro oh it just had the hydraulics for the deck well that's i guess that's okay but these little machines are cool i always like the little bowling's tube frame and i think could be wrong but i think that's your diff lock you actually unlock one wheel but little toolbox back here tool tray it's missing the seat and no biggie but that'll be a fun one to get going so will that at was charbers i am tired but this turns over real good i think it'll be a perfect engine for that blower so we just got to get it all Ooh, that's not ever a good sign but just got to get everything unloaded put stuff that don't need to be wet under the shed and start working on some of the other stuff start making videos look at the windings and stuff on that generator you don't realize how heavy that thing that was extremely heavy but so there you go guys trailer load of goodies and there's a whole lot of will it run videos right there on the trailer the little cushman i want to try to keep it oh no we broke the headlight loading it i think i might actually have one of these this will be a cool little rig once it's all restored i mean i'll restore it the best i can the bed you know it's rotted out in places so it's gonna need a lot of work but the majority of it's there so hope you enjoyed the video guys stay tuned to the channel if you haven't already like and subscribe and we will see y'all on the next one later